Phase one has begun. Saute the Italian sausage. Mmm, smells so good. Make the dough. Don't overwork it. Pretty. Cut the mozzarella into cubes. Not the go, so we're gonna get that. They're gonna melt inside the Easter pie, so I don't make them too big or too small. And I always put a little extra. Recipe calls for two cups. That's a little extra. One for eating. Mmm, delicious. So to make one Easter pie calls for, the filling calls for six eggs. We've got six good eggs here. So let's do that. Get all six in here. We put those in. Then we're gonna add our mozzarella, the sausage, and some Parmesan cheese, and some black pepper. And once we get those in, then we'll roll out the dough. All right, so now we're gonna make the filling. Our six eggs. And we're gonna um, get that over our meat and cheeses. Gotta get me a little spatula, I'll be right back. Yeah, you don't wanna waste any of that good stuff in that bowl, right? These were uh, my mom's bowls. He's one of these colored bowls here. There's a set of, I think, four. That big yellow one over there has the dough. Okay. Now we're going to mix that up, and then after that, going to roll out the dough, and then we're almost there. All right, so what we want to do, first of all, is take about, pinch off about a quarter of this dough that we made, because we're going to need that for our topping. That looks like about a quarter, maybe a little more. All right, there we go. And we're gonna roll out this dough to go in that nice big deep dish pie pan. I like to kind of press it out a little bit, get it shape. And then I take my grandma's rolling pin, roll her out. Okay, back in a few minutes to show you what it looks like. Get in there. I know it doesn't look round, but don't worry, it'll all work. <laughs> okay, so the dough's in there. Now we're just gonna tap it down so it's on the bottom of the pan. You'll see some areas where we might need a little more dough on that side. Let's just scoot it over a little bit. You can pick it up gently and move it just to get it how you want it. Don't move it too much though. Like I said, don't overwork the dough or mess with it too much. So now I'm just tucking it into the sides here. See, we have a little spot over there. We'll just add some dough to that, it'll be fine. Uh, and that looks nice now, doesn't it? Okay, so. All right, let's get our filling in that beautiful deep dish pie here. And I've already made the top that goes on it. So that's just sitting there waiting for us. And again, get all the goodies out. Oops, little pieces of cheese. Don't try to escape. Smush it around a little bit. So it's nice and even and up against that crust. Beautiful. Now I'll take this right here. See if we made it big enough. <laughs> Looks good so far. Yeah. Ba bam. <laughs> ba bam is right. So now I like to tuck it down so it sits on top of those goodies. And then, since this is not a standard pie dish, as you can see, I don't care if we fold it in, which is what we're going to do. Or we'll just make it nice and pretty on the edges. We'll see how it. it the pie will tell me what to do. <laughs> it a little bit. We want to make it nice and tight because we we don't want that good filling coming out and spilling over. 
But if it does, it does. Okay. So I got the top on. See, it looks pretty cool. I just kind of touched in with my finger to make it, you know, look a little nicer. But now um, you have to put a, a an egg yolk glaze on here. I threw away my brush that I would normally do this with because it was old and I didn't want to use it. So I'm going to do it with my hands, which are just as good. So we're just gonna smoosh that around all over the place to put a nice egg yolk glaze on this. It's coming to life. Life. <laughs> Getting there, huh? That's like the phrase for 2020. Getting there. Okay. Got that all the way around. Okay. And then the final thing on this is I have just a little bit of flour here on my fork. And I'm going to punch holes in this. And in between each punch, reflower your fork so it goes in and out well. And that's just so the filling has a place, the steam has a place to go. Hit some sausage there. Hey, by the way, the cheese I use in this is mozzarella and Parmesan. And then we'll do one in the middle. Bam! Okay, we're done. It looks like it. Okay, preheated the oven to 350 for the first 20 minutes, and then it goes to 320, I think it is, for an hour. Oops, that's microwave. That won't work. <laughs> <laughs> this will, though. Got some aluminum foil down there just in case it. There we go. 20 minutes at. Where's my timer? All right. Are you wearing pajamas? Yes, I'm cooking in my PJs, but I do have my apron on. My daddy gave me. All righty. Ooh, pretty. She's a beauty. Ah, ooh, so heavy. I love that. And there she is. Gonna get her out of the pan next. So she can breathe a little bit. Don't want her cooking anymore. Oh, she's gorgeous. And there it is. Italian Easter pie. Easter pie. Yum. Hallelujah. <laughs>